welcome to my channel my name is toby actually if this is your first time here you are super welcome i am so excited to have you here with me so this vlog is different because i'm going to be showing you a productive day in my life so normally i'll start my day with a morning routine you don't get to see the full routine here but i have a proper morning routine video coming up soon so yeah, I'm just dressing my bed, making sure that everything is straightened out because for me to start my day productively, I have to start from how my morning is. So I dress the bed, I get my Bible and my journal to have my morning devotion. I do this every morning. And so this month I'm studying the book of Romans and it's been interesting so far. I again I would have a proper morning routine so I'll show you how I go about this in a more detailed video coming up soon. And so after my morning routine I get something to eat for breakfast, usually a cup of tea or coffee and just a snack. Hi guys, how are you doing? Good afternoon. Today I decided to do a day in my life video and I am working outside so I found a place to just sit down and cook a bit before we head back home. If I can I will show you around but there are a few people, a few more people in that is here. So it's going to be probably a little bit difficult to do that. But yeah, so we're working from Starbucks today trying to clean up my email post that is passing on the 20th if you haven't registered you should register i'm going to leave a link in the description box so that you can check down where to start so yeah so you're going to be working with me today and basically just seeing a single day in my life so sit back and relax and enjoy So on this day, I start my productive day after my morning routine with a couple of meetings. So this morning, I have a client meeting. Usually, it starts by 9 a.m. and runs up for two hours. So I had this meeting from 9 up until 11 a.m. this morning. So this is me going back and forth with the client, talking about areas of research and all of that to continue with the projects that we are working on. Today I wanted to work from outside because I felt like I needed to be out of my space to do a more productive work and sometimes this could happen you feel like staying indoors is not helping you and so you want to work out. It's a good thing that we are now opening up slowly and gradually so I was able to go out and work in a workstation. 
basically i just went to starbucks but it has a terrace so it's open and it's safe to walk there so it has a terrace and it's open so it's safe to walk there in this period so i get in the metro in the train and go all the way to starbucks So this is how the site has, um, not the site, the work is coming out today, seven days of personal development challenge and we're going to be talking about every aspect of personal development. So this is what we are working on today and hopefully we can finish it before it's time to head back home. Oh yeah, look how this spots my name. It's always interesting to see the different ways people spell Toby. I mean, they tried, they did an E before and then they changed it, so yay. Okay, so let's get to work. So when I finished with what I had to do for the day, when it comes to my own personal work, I also indulged in some personal development for myself because I don't just tell you to get better and be a better version of yourself. I actually work towards that myself. And so this is one of the courses that I am currently taking. It's a personal development course and so I had this for just under an hour. And so now that I am done with work outside, it's time to head back home. So I get back on the train and start my journey home. So I have to get my steps in, steps are complete, so I'm going to walk by the CN, for CN in English. And it's a beautiful day. I have both icons. Hi guys, so before I end this vlog, I wanted to uh, sit, I'm sitting <laughs> and chat a bit with you or something. So there's this book I'm reading, it's a, well, what's it called? It's a book by, I forgot the name of the author, but basically what, there was one part that I was reading um, yesterday and she was talking about how you expect somebody to change but what you are doing to make that person behave the way the person is behaving you're not ready to change it. so basically it was like you you point fingers at somebody's errors and what somebody else is doing and uh, or what they are doing in reaction to what you're doing but you're not ready to see what you're doing so you're expecting person b to change in the way that they talk to you at certain times but what you do that makes them talk to you in that way you're not ready to see it. so you're expecting somebody to change and you not ready to fix that and then she was just elaborating on how if you're expecting to see change you should start from yourself and i know we hear it all the time basically you should be the change that you want to see and all of that and as much as it is easy to um point fingers at some other person's errors and some other person's fault it is 
not supposed to be like that because if you're expecting somebody to change in the way that they react or respond or talk or relate with you it should start from how you behave because nobody just behaves well some people behave anyhow at any given time whenever they have the chance to but basically if you're expecting somebody to change towards you you should be ready to start changing so if you don't like the way somebody talks to you how about you start changing in the way that you respond how about you start changing the way you you speak when the person is around or the way you react to what the person says and all of that basically if you want to see change in somebody else's reactions to you you should start from yourself so change what you do change how you do not to change your person and this is not to say you should start behaving in a way that is not you but if you're expecting to see a difference you should start from yourself so what are you doing wrong that is making person b to react the way the person is reacting or person c to react the way the person is reacting so be the change that you want to see and start from yourself basically and that being said i would also want to invite you to join me in the seven days personal development challenge where we'll be talking about this particular topic in one of the days basically how you um start to change your mindset how you start to work on yourself to be the better version the best version of yourself that way you're helping others to also be the best version of themselves because if somebody's going to come up to you and speak in a rude way and you're not responding in a rude way you're making the person think of how the person has reacted what the person has done and how wrong it is so basically in these seven days i said basically a lot i don't know why i do that and yeah in this seven days personal development challenge we're going to be looking at seven different pillars of personal development so the different aspects of personal development that you should be working on so your mindset your health physical spiritual emotional mental health your goal setting planning big picture accountability discipline and all of that is going to be interesting it's for seven days and all you need to do in that seven days is to give me one hour basically in that literally that's it you're just giving me one hour to go through all of the things that i need to go through it's not going to be cumbersome and it's going to be very interactive in the sense that it's going to be everything that you get you're going to be able to relate and re respond to it and work with it it's not going to be tedious it's not going to be so much work and it's not going to drain you because in working towards being the best version of yourself you don't need something that is going to be boring or something that's going to make you to give up on the way so it is not going to be any of that it's going to be very helpful so if you would like to join me in that seven days personal challenge please check the link in the bio i'll leave it there so that you can join in and if you would like to invite others to please feel free to share the link with them and invite them because something that the only thing that is better than you going to be the best version of yourself is you doing it with your circle with your friends with your family so come together join the seven days personal development challenge and let's all grow to be the best version of ourselves so that's it for me for you today i hope you enjoyed this vlog i hope you enjoyed listening to me walking with me working with me eating with me and all of the other things that you have seen basically a small bit in the day in my life basically a small part of my life in this day so i hope you enjoyed this vlog please let me know if you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up if you liked it share with your friends and family if you would like to see more content like this please let me know leave your comments in the comment section if you want me to talk on any other thing please share with me in the comment section if this is your first time seeing me thank you so much for watching this vlog and i hope you watch other videos that i have up on my channel please do remember to subscribe to this channel and share with your friends and family and i'll catch you on sunday for another upload have a wonderful day and enjoy the rest of your week mm -hmm.